hi guys welcome back again to my channel thank you so much for stopping by to watch this video i really appreciate so guys in today's video we'll be traveling from ibada to lagos via railway train yes don't go anywhere keep watching We are on our way to train station. Yeah. They no bond the devil where this morning. Maybe it's, we, not possible. it's not possible. We cannot be late because it's still very, very early. The devil cannot allow oh, no. <laughs> it's not possible. So, guys, now we are ready to go, and you can see Patiti was trying to cross the road. Anyway, we left my house around 6 35 a.m. in the morning, and this road actually leads to Monia. Of course, this is Monia area in Ibadan. So, if you are going to the train station, it is advisable that you leave your house very, very early. Okay, now. This road is well towed, no portal, like it's really, really encouraging. And I need to tell you, no hold up at all. Okay, now see the life on bike. Yeah, we took bike because we wanted everything to be very, very fast. But if you are going with your car, it's actually okay. It's cool as well. There is no hold up on the way. Okay, now right now we already around the train station area. You can see construction is still going on around the area. So guys, this is how the old place looks like. Early in the morning, yeah. You can see the workers are already here. Yeah, they've resumed back to work. The time right now is uh, 20 minutes past the hour of 7. Ah, sorry, 7.20. I'm speaking as if I'm in radio station. <laughs> oh, God. So guys, right now we are ready to pay and they have different price lists like they have the economic class for 2,500 Naira and the business class is for 5,000 Naira while first class is for 6,000 Naira. So guys, I paid for that of 2,500 Naira which is the economic class which I will be showing you how the economic class in this train looks like. Don't go anywhere, keep watching. You're already here and... Uh... Guys, I actually messed up. I thought they would be getting my, they would collect my uh, school ID card. So they said, no, they don't collect school ID card. So if you are coming here, of course, make sure you come with your uh, national ID card, whatever, driving like uh, ID or uh, what, what else again? Uh, international passport, yeah. So Fatutu was able to cover it for me. See, wait, wait, can these people hear me say? I don't even know. Fatutu is feeling us. I am the coverer. Yeah, she covered for me with her ID. I would have cried today, assuming they I'm like her mommy. Yes, of course. Mom, mommy, mommy, Fatutu. <laughs> Let me show you guys around. So guys, this is how the station looks like, but it's still under construction. You can hear the noise, and uh, here is Fatuti. He's having a conversation with uh, one of their workers. So this is how it looks like. I hope you guys like my Ankara mask. <laughs> oh my god. So guys, at this point, we're so excited because it's actually our first time of entering into train in Nigeria. So we are so glad and excited about it. So guys, the train came around 7.37 on dot because I was trying to check the time so that I can give you guys proper information about the it. And here, right and now, we are ready to enter. Yeah, people are already moving in because it's already 7.38 at this point. So guys, at this junction, everybody is trying to move in. And guys, I was really, really amazed by the numbers of, like, the turn up numbers. Because this is a new train in Nigeria. And for some Nigerians now, it's quite uh, expensive. Especially if you are moving from Ibadan to Lagos. But a lot of people really prefer those trains. So guys, see Patiti is on her way to first class because she will be boarding first class and this is where your baby girl class, will be class, entering. So guys, before we can enter, you'll be searched and they will check your tickets and they will tell you your seat number and your nose masks is very, very important. So guys, right now, this is how the 
inside of the autonomy class looks like this class is with 88 seats so once you enter just look for your seat number and sit where you ought to sit so right now the girl is in one thing unique about you know this train especially the, for the fact that i'm sitting beside the window is the sockets and guys my power bank is not charged like it's not well charged so i'll be charging my power bank first <laughs> you know now i'm a typical nigeria we know the gay lights every now and then as for me now for the past four days now for my area we know gay lights because there was an accident that happens along the express that you know affected our light and since then they've not been able to fix it so let me show you right now my power is charging you can see where right? the amazing thing is if you are hungry and you want to get some snacks they have people all around here that sell snacks like that woman now she sells snacks so you can just get it and come and eat it inside the train so guys the time right now is 7 50 and the hostesses are already on their way coming in they are the one on black and yellow if you are not traveling with the train or you are still on board, kindly exit the train and the train will take off in five minutes. So guys, now we are about to move. Yeah, we are about to move. We are moving. And the time is 8 o'clock on dot. Like, this is wonderful. <laughs> So guys, exactly 8.20, they came around to check the ticket and to, you know, stamp the ticket. Is it a stamp? I don't really know. But they came for the, yeah, ticket. They came to check to be sure that everyone inside the plane, I said plane, oh my God, everyone inside the train actually paid for it. So that is my ticket. You know, she has actually stamped the ticket to be sure that, okay, it has been used. So guys, it's already 8.35 now still moving of course and when it was around 8 20 the previous clip you saw they came to check the tickets to be sure that everyone that enters you know paid for their tickets like they paid the fee you get so i'm actually trying to edit the video that will be coming up today yeah and seriously guys we are practicing social distancing like for real so guys this is to let you know that construction is going on in some areas even before you get to abe okuta so right now just take a look at this area they are still working hardly they are working tirelessly this life now turn by turn tomorrow devil Nobody could, nobody. So guys, right now we are at Abiyokuta and it's just an hour, you know, it's, it's movement. Yeah. I hope you guys can hear that. Yeah, so guys, uh, we are already at Abiyokuta and seriously, I've not been to Abiyokuta before. It's my first time. So let me just show you guys around. Yeah, let me show you how the uh, train area, what's it called? How it looks like in Abiyokuta. Nobody good, nobody bad, and nobody perfect. If it's in my day, if it's on my day, go go on my day. So guys, people are set to enter at Abeokuta. Take a look. I can't go out to show you guys, but from this side, of course, I have to leave my seat just to show you guys. And this is the building that is going on. This is the construction. Yeah, they are really doing a very good job. So people are already entering. Let me go back to my seat now so guys right now we are leaving abe okuta and you guys can see yeah this is abe okuta for you so guys this is another terminal i don't know the name of this terminal it's just after 30 minutes that we left abe okuta so we actually we didn't stop but okay we actually stopped here but we didn't stay so long i think one of the uh, some of their workers wanted to follow us to lagos so they have to stop a little bit for those people so that they can come in. Guys, right now, I think we're very, we are very close to Lagos, but then I want to be with you, so I want to take you guys to their toilet, okay? Guys, let me drop my bag first. Oh my god, guys, this is amazing. I love this. 
Okay, okay. Enough of that. So guys, this is how the toilet looks like. It's actually very, very clean. Yeah, take a look. It's very, very clean and uh, everywhere is still sparkling, like sparkling, sparkling things here. Yeah. So this is the washing base. I dropped my bag here and uh, I don't know what is this. Room. It looks like stopwatch, but I don't know. So, okay. I want we will, but still they come, okay? to flush this is what we need to press yeah so i'm done here yeah. so let's go back to our seats So guys, one thing I would like you to know is from Ibadan to Lagos, there are so many terminals that they are still working on. Like I asked one of their workers and I was told that sometimes they work day and night. So they are working tirelessly. They are working so hard so that everything can be in places. Like you can see the construction keeps going. They keep working they, because there was no terminal that we passed through that we didn't see any worker like so much worker so anyways right now we're already at lagos but i don't really know this side you know lagos is so big and it's massive so and lagos you can be in a keja you tell people you're already in lagos you can be in lekki you are also in lagos so this is another market square area but it's actually lagos which i don't really know the area so guys this is another terminal entirely what like within lagos alone we saw i saw like five to six terminals within lagos and that is amazing at this junction guys auntie rejoice is hungry yes like i was really really hungry because there was no way to get anything to eat but nevertheless i would like to say this that they have uh, medical practitioners inside the train i saw like two nurses inside the train that they were moving up and down to be sure that everybody is fine everybody is cool and you know i feel like they are doing a great job so guys at this junction we are very close to the last terminal which is the last stop i was so 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 excited when i had them talking that it is time for us to drop so i feel like showing you guys the outer look of the area yeah. guys now we've actually dropped and uh, I want to try and go and see Patuti, the first class lady. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm going the right direction, but I feel I, I'm going there. Like, I feel I'm going to the right direction. Oh my god. Guys, this place is fucking freaking smelling, but forget the smell. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's actually beautiful. Where is this young lady? I can't find her. Where, can I? Where is Patuti? So guys, if you want to travel by air, maybe from Lagos to wherever you're going, you can actually use this train from Ibadan. It is advisable and it is stressless. And the last bus stop is nothing but the best area for you, which is a Butemeta. Hey, see the bus class lady. Oh yeah, see the bus class lady. <laughs> guys, see the Say hello. hello. Oh, how was the experience look like? Don't tease me. Anyway, guys, if you want to know how the experience for first class looks like, just go ahead to our channel and go and see the whole packaging. I'll go ahead. I'll go there as well. I'll go and watch, okay? Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys really enjoy the trip with me. Please don't forget to like this video, share this video, and subscribe if you are new. I will see you guys in my next one. So, bye.